Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Charles Young, also known as Open Thoughts, back at you again. Um, I want to talk about um, um, some personal experiences that I experienced that I thought I never would experience, um, especially being in the mind state that I was in um, when I experienced them. And uh, one of them is uh, talking about going snowboarding. Now, growing up, um, I was always meant to believe that there was a particular thing associated with a particular race um, and it wasn't meant for everybody to do uh, it was always seen as that's something that uh, and not in my case that white people do or um, uh, or some or it's not for us are you crazy or it's too cold and I mean I understand that a lot of people don't really um, enjoy the coldness and you know that's perfectly fine but me, I was going through this transition where, man, I had the dreads, the locks, down here, man, thought I was Rastafarian, thought I was all these different things, man, but really what I was was depressed and confused. And, <laughs> and from what I learned from that experience, man, what happened was, you know, going, you know, dealing with you, one thing I learned about this is that you, you have to know who to tell certain uh, information you can't just tell everybody because, man, if you tell everybody, man, they'll discourage you and you won't go through the process. That's why when you have a great idea, you keep it closed um, in your mind until you're able to work on it or want to, or be working on it so that when you give that idea up to those individuals that you're surrounding, they can't discourage you in a way from starting that particular um, situation uh, or whatever that event is. Now, so... Man, I ain't never been out of where I where I've lived by myself on my own, man. I I've never been in this place. So of course, man, I'm worried and nervous, man. I got that, man. It's 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 in the DNA to be worried and frustrated and, and kind of nervous because that was programmed into me. Now, on that particular light, man, I'm like, man, forget this. I'm taking a chance, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to go snowboarding for my first time, man. I don't even know where the idea came from going snowboarding. I just knew that I had to do it. That's it. I just knew that I had to do it. And what I what happened was, man, I finally got the rental car, man, and I'm sitting in the car, and the person that I'm with at the particular time is like freaking me out. Do you got this? Do you got this? Do you got that? Do you got this? Do you got that? I'm like, I'm cool. I'm fine. I'm calm. I'm trying to stay calm, but I'm about to lose my shit because... I may not not have all these things that this person's asking me, which is pushing me closer and closer and closer and closer back to putting that rental car back, <laughs> getting out that car, staying home and saying happy birthday to, uh, right there in this particular area down there. Now, I, you know, as this is going on, man, I flip out. I flip out on the person. I'm like, yo, I ain't got all this stuff. I'm not worrying about all this stuff. I'm just trying to do it. And I'm just trying to do it because I'm like, man, for me, man, if I overthink it, it's not going to happen. And a lot of people think that way. You know, if you overthink something for too long, man, you create this whole big tree of wonder and what ifs. And you know what I'm saying? And I was like, man, let me keep this at seed at the ground level because I'm going to go. So, you know, that person had to back off. I had to show that person to back off. And I had to have confidence within myself to make that person back off. So now I get to the place, man, I'm going, going snowboarding for the first time and driving up there by myself, me and my music. And I get there and... I, I, I go, you know, I go into the place, and man, it's just me, and you know what I'm saying? I'm not the type of person that goes to any place by myself, um, but it, it's just me, because I'm like, man, I'm, you know, I'm facing these fears, so I get to the place, um, then I'm gonna go snowboard, man, get all my stuff and equipment, man, and I'm like, man, this is my first time, I don't know what's gonna happen, am I gonna break it, and I'm looking all around, and I'm seeing these young children, you know what I'm saying? I'm seeing children at the ages of like, man, like five, you know, five, six years old. And I'm so, you know, I'm so lady looking at them going down these slopes and man, skiing and doing all this stuff. I'm like, man, I got, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I, 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 as I'm going through this, man, I'm still like, I'm still nervous. I'm still worried about it because I don't know what's gonna happen. But see, that's the thing about experiences. We put so much um, um, emphasis on what's gonna happen or we have these so many expectations on what should happen when we get there, not knowing that life is just about the experience. There's no negative and positive experience. It's just the experience and the information we take from it. That's it. So with that happening, man, I'm like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like worried like, oh man, am I gonna fall? Am I gonna bust my ass? Well, you know, whatever the case may be. 
So the first time, man, I got on them damn slopes, man, and I was falling. You know what I'm saying? I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling. I'm falling, I'm falling, but I keep telling myself, man, next year I'm gonna get better. And, and even on the first time I was there at that particular moment, um, uh, I almost injured myself to where, you know, I felt like I dislocated my leg. Now, I, now I can't get out the snow, man. I'm stuck. It's me by myself. The classes are over, man. People are about to leave, and I'm stuck in the snow with a dislocated, almost feeling like a dislocated leg, man, because I can't move my leg. Or my leg's getting numb. <laughs> And I'm like, I'm not going to die out here like this. Because <laughs> I'm like, man, now I'm kind of flipping. But I realized that, man, forget this, man. I got out here and I told myself I'm going to make it there and I'm going to make it back. So for some reason, I, the, the, the feeling went away. Um, I got up and I was like, man, I took that board and I said, hey, today that's enough. Now the following year, man, I'm so excited about this. I mean, you know, I'm so excited that I went, I, I went out of my comfort zone. That it actually increased me to go out of my comfort zone, man. I went to places like Mexico. I went to California. I went to um, different places, Florida. I'm going to different places and having different experiences, Las Vegas, because I, because I never, you know, what I'm saying, and I never expected to leave my area, but I did, and it changed my whole perception about going to places now I, now for me as a person I have to stay consistent with those things if I don't you know what I'm saying I can fall back into the same hole which that's understanding yourself so but I'm able to go to these experiences man and I'm able to do all these things based upon that one trip now the following year I try to start trying to invite people man and I invited one person that, that went with me and and I'm like okay cool you know, you know, let's do this. And they, you know, they experienced it and they didn't really like it. You know, I tried to invite a lot of other di other different people, but they thought I was crazy. Man, you going snowboarding, man. Black people don't go snowboarding. You know what I'm saying? All that, all that programming, those, um, those uh, kicks that, that make you say stuff like that. And I'm like, man, I'm going again. And the second year, man, same thing, man. I went up there, everything was cool. It was real dark when I went up there. So I was nervous, man. So I went in a different condition, raining. It was crazy, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't see, I can't see the road in front of me, bro. Like, it's, it's crazy. But then what ends up happening, man, I get there, man, and me and the other individual, and she has the same experience that I had the first time. You know what I'm saying? Kind of falling or whatever. But I got a little bit better. And I told myself, man, I'm going again. I'm going again the next year, and this time I'm not gonna fall.